हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल ऑफ यू एंड वेलकम बैक आवर ऑनलाइन क्लास साइंस एथ स्टैंडर्ड स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू आवर एथ चैप्टर दैट इज रिप्रोडक्शन एंड एडोलशंस इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो ऑलरेडी आई हैव एक्सप्लेन टू यू व्हाट इज दैट एडोलशंस एंड पॉवर्टी ओके एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट दैट व्हाट इज दैट सेकेंडरी सेक्सुअल कैरेक्टर्स फ्रेंड्स आई ऑलरेडी एक्सप्लेन टू यू the what is that adolescent periods and there are different stages of that uh, periods of in our human beings first of all i told that when that our life cycle are uh, different stages are it is running the when from the birth to 2 years that is called as infancy periods and from the 2 to 11 years that is called as a childhood periods and from the 11 to 18 or 19 that is called as a adolescent periods also Uh, 13 to 19 also we can say that is called as a teenage stages and 8 to 19 above that we should say what is that our adult food periods yes but we have discussed and during this time what happening the our poverty that means when the phase of that things it is increasing that sexual during that adolescent periods already i have told to you the secondary sexual characters are developing okay so what is the set secondary sexual characters for the boys and the girls these are the difference okay for the secondary characters of the human beings of for the girls and the boys are the difference so during this adolescent periods the secondary sexual characters are developing that it is in growing so how it is different from boys to one girl we will discuss in this video so let us discuss first of all what is the secondary characters the characters which the characters which develop during the puberty that means during the time whenever that hormones growth hormones and sex hormones are developing at that time that is puberty and the help to distinguish a male from a female are also called secondary sexual characters how can we find out what is whether it is one female or male so during this puberty time the different sexual characters are developing and by that way we can distinguish we can find out a male from a boy a female that means we can say it is a particular he is belongs to male and she is belongs to female yes so what are the characters what are the different characters are there we will discuss and we will find out here so first of all we'll discuss about that what is the secondary characters in males secondary sexual characters in males okay what is the secondary sexual characters in men's okay what are that now first of all there are so many sexual characters sir we will find out during the puberty and we will see discuss in this now first of all developing of facial hair in the form of mustard and a beard take place first of all one thing what happen the mustard and a beard will develop okay the hair facial hairs will develop during the this periods or that adolescent periods what will happen that mustard and a beards will develop for the boys but not for the girls okay second things the development of hair on the armpit and on the chest and the pubic regions of course also hair will develop where under the armpit on the chest and on the pubic regions where that our uh, sexual uh, that uh, special for that uh, which region that is penis near the penis that pubic regions are there and that uh, near that penis that uh, that hair should will develop that is called as the pubic region okay and next how many boys become deeper as the boys was enlarged what will happen during this period puberty periods the voice our larynx that the uh, voice box will la enlarge and due due to that uh, what will happen that voice our the voice will change that it will become deeper okay shoulder become broader the shoulder become bolder that means it will be strong and it will be enlarge and uh, 
the body become muscular our body muscles also will become tight and it will become strong okay so that means physical appearance also it will change our growth section suddenly it will be changed so these are about the uh, secondary sexual characters did you understand friends so similarly we'll discuss about that what is the secondary sexual characters in female like that uh, what are that secondary sexual characters in female female purposes what happening now first of all the development of breast take place that in the female cases their breast will be enlarged and it will grow next second development of hair under the armpits and in the pubic pubic regions of course same like boys the pubic regions also it will be the near the vagina that it will be develop the hairs and also under the armpits same like boys also uh, under the armpit also the hairs will develop third cases the development of curves in the body take place the curves the body shape also it will become curved from the uh, wrist middle portion that it will become just like a curve like portion okay and a beginning beginning of the menstrual cycle take place it will start that menstrual cycle uh, periods okay friends so these are the special different sexual characters for a boys and a girls did you have get idea about the friends first of all the boys is a little different from the girls so that way we should find out that this is special the boys character and this is the girl character in the boys character most of the beards are present but in the girls cases it won't be and especially the breast that it will be developed in that girls cases but in the boys cases it won't be developed and in the shoulders it will be become very strong but in girls cases the body curve line structures menstrual cycle structures it will start in the beginning um, phase in the girls but there is no menstrual cycle for the boys like that difference are there for the sexual secondary sexual characters for boys and females okay students so these are all about that secondary sexual okay friends thank you all of you students and write down this all the notes in your notebooks this for boys and girls thank you all of you have a nice day